when I first got into the alarm industry, I worked for this company called Rollins for about a year, and then I ended up selling an alarm system to Dick Sampson's neighbor. I wish he wasn't too happy about it, but it got his attention, and that's how we um, met, and he hired me. He had passion for the industry and for what he was doing, which brought a different feel to it than any other company. It's a wonderful place. It's almost like it was a family, and now it's evolved into a big family. So even as we bring other companies on, they all come in and they get this um, family aspect about it. Most of the salespeople have been here 10, 15, 20, 30 years. I mean, and some have gone, left, and come back. I think the true measure of um, companies, how long people stay here voluntarily, you're able to go out and talk to people and promise them things that you know the company's gonna deliver. And uh, that, for a salesperson, is something very important. We give a lifetime service policy. We kind of stay with the uh, customer and, and share the responsibility of that system for as long as they live in the house. And there's not another company out there that does that. In many places today, service is a lost art, and we stake our hat on it. And your laptop breaks, you throw it, we get a new one. Same with your TV. But you can't throw your alarm system away, and that's the philosophy we go on. When you look out there and you see what else is available, if you want to get into the alarm business, I, I can't see another company. I've seen them all come and go and come and go. If you think in terms of alarm systems, this is a company to work for. And the proof in the pudding is none of the salespeople leave. They're always looking ahead to see how they can um, be fair or what can we do for you. While they're asking you also what can you do for us, but they're always looking for what we can do for you.